Angelina Jolie calls for domestic violence training programs for judicial officers and charges judge handling her custody battle with ex-husband Brad Pitt of being biased. Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie were among the most popular couples in Hollywood. Before their two-year marriage, which was short-lived, they dated for 12 years. In 2016, Jolie surprised the world by filing for divorce. Since then, their legal disputes have persisted. They were praised as one of Hollywood's most famous power couples, having a close bond and growing their family both naturally and through adoption. Together, they raised a family of six children, including the twins Knox Leon and Vivienne Marcheline, sons Maddox and Pax Thien, and girls Zahara Marley and Shiloh Nouvel. Angelina Jolie has expressed worries about possible prejudice in the court presiding over her case with ex-husband Brad Pitt as their ongoing custody dispute plays out. She is now actively working for change, and in a two-page letter dated September 29, she urged California Governor Gavin Newsom to adopt Piqui's law. This legislation is being considered to stop kids from being put in reunification camps where they could have to live with violent parents. The law also aims to provide thorough training programs on domestic violence for judges and mediators, highlighting the importance of treating child abuse and trauma in such circumstances. You will be aware that Piqui's law derives its name from a five-year-old boy who suffered a tragic fate killed by his father in April of 2017. Angelina Jolie reportedly stated in her letter, Ana Estevez, Piqui's mother, attempted to have her child protected in a California family court, but she was unsuccessful. In order to prevent authorities from ignoring or dismissing the indicators of abuse, which sadly result in suffering and death for many children in our nation, Ana has worked with California legislators for the past six years.